Oh boy, it's a number that's just not supposed to go down. 2% fewer Utahns wore seatbelts last year compared to 2019. And 80 more people died in 2021 compared to 2019 on the roads. So troopers say it's time for click it or ticket. March 12th, Saturday morning, two men in a van suddenly hit head-on by a sanitation truck that had moved into oncoming traffic. They were driving safely, except they didn't have seat belts on, and both men died. UHP Major Bo Mason says that's too familiar. We actually saw this a week ago. That person was doing everything right, driving safely, doing everything right, except for wearing their seatbelt, and they were the fatality in that accident. Click it or ticket has become a familiar catchphrase. UHP and 52 other law enforcement agencies say people need to listen. And what it boils down to is, is the choices that people are making. When we see uh, factors like wearing your seatbelt and uh, decreasing our speed, we see a decrease in fatalities. About 88% of the people in the state of Utah wear a seatbelt. That means that 22% don't. Um, the startling number is that those 22% account for over 50% of the fatalities in road, Utah roadways. There are two parts to the Click It or Ticket campaign. The first is watching this story right now. Education, reminding everyone to be smart. Because the second is going after those who make the wrong choice before they get hurt. Every county in the state will have troopers out doing that and they will focus on nothing but seatbelt usage and they'll be out there writing a lot of citations, probably not giving a lot of warnings. Sergeant Eric Prescott leads the incident reconstruction team and he's upset his crew has seen so much death this year. They're preventable crashes and yet we're having to go and tell people's loved ones that they died simply because they chose not to wear a seatbelt or that they were distracted. So the Click It or Ticket Blitz runs from May 23rd to June 5th. Zero Fatalities Utah has a new dashboard on their website. It keeps a twice daily count of Utah's traffic injuries and deaths. Just go to zerofatalities.com statistics.